800 supporters in Eamon DC Park for this SSE Ertristi League first division encounter of Galway United and Cork City Galway second coming into tonight's match they're nine points behind Shells Shells away to UCD this evening Barry Coffey Dylan McGlade up against O'Keefe McGlade's cross is met by Murphy but he can't keep his shot on target City with just three wins in the league this season they need to start getting victories to get into the playoff conversation O'Brien Whitmarsh goes down the line his younger brother Joe signed for the club this week O'Brien Whitmarsh might fancy a goal he has a shot it deflects around Connor Kearns formerly of UCD and St. Pat's deals with it well City without Hackett and Morrissey and Beattie this evening Barry Coffey has arrived on loan recently and it has bolstered the squad here he is wearing number 14 Dylan McGlade McGlade looks to open Galway up McGlade oh he squeezed it home Dylan McGlade's third of the season makes it Galway United nil Cork City won it may have taken a slight deflection off Mikey Place on the way through but those fans don't care Galway particularly good from these types of situations Waweru gets his head on it it bounces past McNulty and it's all level Waweru's sixth of the season makes it Galway United 1 Cork City 1 Dylan McLeod Hurley's on the outside that's the option he goes with Hurley's cross pushed out by Kearns but only as far as Dara Crowley who tucks it away nicely what a finish from the Kinsale man that was not an easy one to score but he did it from an acute angle Conor McCormick taking the corner the former Cork City man McCormick originally from Louds receives it back puts the cross in City clear it but we do have some more defensive work to do here David Hurley forces a good save out of Mark McNulty it was a good effort from former Cove Ramblers and Ring Matin Rangers man David Hurley McCormick with another corner Bruder's header it's gone in it's 2 old. a second in two weeks from former Limerick defender Killian Bruder Coleman's header oh surely that's a handball oh that's a stonewall penalty City may feel they're owed a bit of luck because they were denied a certain penalty but it's Galway who are on the attack here Doherty shot well saved by McNulty Keating follows up it's another fine save by McNulty City on the counter attack. Dylan McLeod with that Grealish like run. McLeod stays cool under pressure, looks for Walker, finds him via Keating. Walker pulls it back for Sean Kennedy, who scores his first goal for Cork City. What a time to do it! Kennedy, formerly of Tralee, and Sunderland makes it go with United 2, Cork City 3. Keating and Rowe standing over this one Rowe from Wexford played college football in the States that's a good save from Mark McNulty can City hang on and get what would be a huge three points City have done it they have come to aim in DC Park and got an incalculably big victory it's not just about the points it's about the boost that it will give everyone who has worked so hard so far this season just the fourth win of the season for City in the league and it sets up the match against Cove Ramblers at Turner's Cross next week very nicely.